book, Giant George, Life with the World's Biggest Dog, written by his owner, Dave Nasser. So just how big is George Cameron Matheson? Cameron! You're with me to find out. Do tell. Good morning, Cam. You guys. You guys are having just way too much fun there. It sounds like you're having a rave in, in Times Square. He, George, when you meet this dog, I'm telling you, you, you're not sure if he actually is a dog or if he's a horse or part giraffe. I mean, he's so intimidating that people usually cross to the other side of the street when they see him out for a walk. But in reality, he's a total gentleman. In fact, I think I made a new buddy. Take a look. The camera just loves him. He has over 90,000 Facebook fans, over a million hits on YouTube, and he's even been a guest on Oprah. Hi, George. This super-sized celeb is Giant George, a great Dane, so great he holds the Guinness record for tallest dog in the world. But back home in Tucson... Hi, I'm Dave. And I'm Christy. And this is our dog, George. George is just one of the family. And in the new book, Giant George, Life with the World's Biggest Dog, it's clear that this world record holder is really happiest at home, crowded on the couch. I decided to pay a visit to meet this top dog. Okay, so at first, I was a little shocked. Wow, he's, he's huge. So how big is he? George is 43 inches from paw to neck and weighs in at 245 pounds. That's almost twice as tall as the average Golden Retriever, 100 pounds heavier than the average Great Dane, and about the same weight as four German Shepherds, 11 Beagles, or 26 Shih Tzus. All in all, he's closer to the size of the average reindeer than dogs. He's so astronomically huge, even for a Dane. So, like, how do they explain it? Yeah, I mean, there's nothing normal about him it's just we happen to get the world's tallest dog <laughs> dave and christy bought their great dane from a breeder in oregon george was actually the runt of the litter what kind of reactions do you get at the vet from other dog owners or other pet owners when you walk in there i have heard is that thing a, a horse where's your probably, saddle yeah, I've heard, yeah we've heard it a million times like he seems you know pretty yeah. well behaved he's a great dog he's just been a dream really he's just a, an awesome dog that's right, George, you and me. Honestly? Yeah, who do you like? He is awesome. Hanging out with George sort of feels like hanging out with a buddy. Cheers, George. George, how does it feel to be so big? You know what I'm talking about? It? It's not to say that this beast isn't a handful. For starters, he eats 110 pounds of food a month. Oh, George, you got some appetite. He is so tall that he can eat food right out of the kitchen sink if he wants. But a typical meal, a quarter of a rotisserie chicken, rice, yogurt, dog food, all gently tossed. And take it away. There you go. And while he does have fun with the dogs that he towers over at the park, <laughs> his preferred pastime, Let's get out of here. a good old golf cart ride. Just one day with this gentle giant. Slow down, George. And I think it's safe to say that we bonded. Yeah, sometimes I feel like that too. He's a world record superstar. You are a huge celebrity. Thank you for taking the time out to, to hang out with us today. A canine celeb who really just wants to be part of the game. I, I gotta tell you, he is so sweet. You're my boy, Blue. George, he's just such a sweet, sweet guy. You might wonder where a dog this massive sleeps. Well, his dog bed is an actual queen bed. He's got his own queen-size mattress that he sleeps on. So life is good for George. And I think he sleeps a little bit more than Geronimo, who you have there in Times Square, who doesn't seem to stop. We do. Thank you, Cameron, for that and bringing us. And you can see more photos of George at goodmorningamerica.com on Yahoo.